Hello, everybody. Oh, Nichan, what are you doing with my pansu? And we're redoing the intro. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Hi. Hey, it's your turn, buddy. Yes. Wait, where are you gonna get? Ah, uh, the auditorium. <laughs> Josh slapped him on the back, by the way. I, I didn't slap him. I put my arm around his shoulder. Oh, that, that is adorable. Room. You said the exact same thing last time. Did I really? That day while rehearsing. That is cute. That that day while rehearsing for the class play, you totally forget your lines. It's terrible. Oh. But you don't let that get you down. You start improvising all your lines, and it's marvelous. Somehow it enhances the path of the play in unexpected ways, and that's saying something since half of your improvisation is a rap battle against your inner fears. You gain plus two creativity. You've already got, like, so many points in that. All right. You spot Zoe and say hello. She seems to be in a pretty good mood. Hey, Spoosmangu. Sorry about running out on you before. I was just overwhelmed by all that cult stuff. Speaking of them, they've actually been a lot better lately. They're still pretty clueless, but at least they haven't given me any more dead animals. <laughs> like a cat. <laughs> I wonder what's gotten into them. Well, better not to mess with this Better not to mess with this success. Anyway, I gotta go study for my ambush finance midterms. Later! As Zoe leaves, you notice her cultist peeking around a corner. When she's gone, they sheepishly approach you. Um, I forgot, I'm a prophet. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So you're actually going down a quest line. Hey, Spoots Magoo. Praise be to you for your unholy wisdom and stuff. We were just wondering, d did Zoe say anything about us? <laughs> Does she like all the dead goats we're not giving her? Are we using the right pronouns? <laughs> We just, we all love her so much, and we want to make sure she's as happy or unhappy or ruthlessly insane as she can possibly be. I love her the most of all. Who said that? Whoever you are, you can't possibly love her more than I do. I'm the one standing oh. at the front. I thought it was him saying that, and he's just insane. No, no it's, I think the quotes, the I love her most is, of all. Yeah, I think the parentheses is, with this is supposed to be a different cult member. I was standing in front last time. We all look the same because we're all wearing masks. Silence! You can't silence me. You're not my grandmaster. Well, well, someone is, right? I mean, we have a grandmaster, don't we? What kind of cult would we be without a grandmaster? We don't, do we? Well, that won't do. Please, Spooks Magoo, grace us with your wisdom. How shall we choose our grandmaster? You need to learn to think like your mistress. Become a high school student for a day, and the answer will be obvious to you. The title of Grandmaster should go to whoever can compose the best theme song to sing to Zoe every morning as if it's oh, a new no. episode of her life. I mean, obviously the top one. Why is that? Oh no. That would be annoying to her, and she wants to get rid of them, Whoops. right? Oh. oh. Anime OP. I thought that she didn't like being annoyed. I thought that was her whole thing. Become a high school student. I thought they were annoying to her. But that would be incredibly. No, no. If this is what Zoe's prophet suggests, then it must be done. Comrades, bring forth a thousand needles. Wait, needles? It is Zoe's will that we will become one high school unit. Let the union of the flesh begin! No, 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 no! This is not good at all! And yet you cannot look away as the cultists sew their pale flesh together! <laughs> I mean, that's... Oh, hey, Spoots Magoo! You have a pencil sharpener? My... Oh, what are they doing now? We are a high school student. <laughs> <laughs> Scream. What? Scream. You just killed her route! No, I didn't. Yes, you did. There's no way. I mean... Dude, I had a chance to save Miranda, yeah. which I near, which I nearly succeeded at. Only he interfered. I think I you still got I a comment, shot. I commented. Besides, we're only on week two. Yeah. Yeah, but this looks like the stuff. Like this was a route point, and I think he just fucked it. Nah. We are high school student. Scream the mutilated cultists in unison. We care about good grades and the status of our facial skin. Oh, you think you've got a good batch of cultists, and then they go and sell their bodies to each other to become a high school student. Every time! Every time! Are you not pleased, mistress? Moans the quivering amalgam of flesh and bone. Of course I'm not pleased! This is so embarrassing! The worst <laughs> cultist ever! Zoe storms off. Looks like you're the worst prophet ever. You lose oh. two charm and one fun. Let's do this thing. It's a minor setback. You'll be okay, um, Frank. Fine. Let's see. Uh, oh, I've, god damn my fucking click heavy fingers! I was gonna say class anyway, so it's fine. You sure? Yeah, I'm fine. Okay. That day the teacher's just tired of teaching, so she recurs to the I'm classic tech. No, that's a pencil. I was gonna say, am I smoking? I know, it looks like that with the, the scribble and all. Yeah. 
Um, I'm not giving Smoking a shit and putting on some sh kind of historical TV show for you to watch. What you don't expect is that it's super effective. God bless the golden era of television. Okay, I've seen this before. Yeah. Uh, around the corner, you hear the sound of princessly singing in Elish maracas, which can only mean one thing. Oh, Mr. Feel the Eel! I'm just so excited for the winter surf party! Okay. I could sing! Oh, I guess. I was going to say that I was so excited I could burn down a medium-sized village, but singing is a great idea, too. Let's do it! How did a I find up a... It must be the, the mind control thing. They call me on Miranda's path. They, it is Little Mermaid songs. How did I not the figure it out? The whole world is from Aladdin, you dumbass. <laughs> you. Yes, I know. I use Stoopy Head. Am I gonna steer? Am I gonna, like, Wait. am I gonna, am I gonna... I was not actually going after Miranda now. You can have Zoe. Will, Will Smith the genie would not be pleased. But 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 Orion, am am I am I like Mr. Steel your ex now? What? The game is putting me on Miranda's round. And oh. last game I fucked you out of getting her. Maybe? I mean, it's possible. Fuck, I'm gonna actually swing on to Miranda now. Okay, yeah, well, yeah, I, well I don't care. She's not actually. Nah, I don't actually have you with the monarchy. I was just working towards an end goal. I don't care. B -b -b I don't. <laughs> That's salty. Um, just goes crying in the just goes runs crying to the bathroom. <laughs> Whatever. Oh, fuck, I mean it's weak too, so I can change. Whatever. Everything's better down when it's wetter under the sea. The little monarch's book of etiquette clearly states murder is one of the. Oh, they break. Oh. No. There's just nothing there. Oh, wait. A whole new save. I don't know the actual. You have sent me through it. God damn it, Josh. I had a moment. You give Miranda and her murderous eel a standing ovation. You were already standing, so technically you just started clapping, but it still counts. Elo! I didn't even <coughs> see you there, fellow surf. You're definitely not a surf, but you're also not about to correct an eel with a hidden switchblade. Cat. The beautiful singing princess. It's such an honor to join you in the magical wonder of song. You know, it's times like these that I'm so happy I have sniffs. I mean, if you weren't here, you would listen to my lovely singing voice. Me? Listen to my own voice? I don't think so. <laughs> Just the thought of Princess Miranda's songs going to waste. <laughs> oh, don't cry, Mr. Feel the Eel. I know. Feel the Eel. I know it will make you feel better. Extensive and laborious party planning. Yeah, you're right, princess. That would cheer me up right away. I knew it! In that case, we're missing one critical thing for the winter surf party. Activities! This will likely be the only party my surfs will ever have the chance to attend, so we should make it as fun and memorable as possible. Oh, me! I'm just bursting with ideas. But princess, could we play Shave the Princess Neck? It's... Each surf could shave your neck with their sharpest sword. Doesn't that sound so adorable? OMG, I love it! Everyone will admire how hairless my neck is! I mean, my neck is already hairless, but I guess if everyone uses a sword on my neck, it will be even more hairless? Or we could negative. dig a special princess pit and fill it up with the cutest animal, feral panthers! Princess Miranda, you could pet the fluffy panthers all night in your special inescapable pit! Yes, yes! Yes, Mr. Feel the Eel, you're a genius! Or we could simply sit you down on your gluttonous throne and read aloud one by one a list of the atrocities and injustices you committed until Poseidon himself slid you down! <laughs> down with the Mer Kingdom! I mean, he did! He did! He, he, did. he, he, did. he, he did. said it! He did say go, I just Feel the Eel is the best character. I mean, <laughs> I love you, princess! Aw, oh, Mr. Feel the Eel, you're so precious! I didn't even know presents could be this cute! Anyways, I was saying, wow, a butterfly! Miranda abruptly leaves to chase the butterfly, but wait, that means you're alone with... Salutations, Salutations comrade! You have done well to weather the tyranny of the Vanderbilt so far, but fear not! The day of their demise fast approaches. The evil princess is finally falling into our trap, just as we intended! She thinks she's just crossing a... choosing a party activity, but she will actually choose the method of her own death! Ha! The irony is as delicious as the sweat of the proletariat! She returns. <laughs> Bye, comrade. May the blood of the monarch salt the earth. I mean, farewell. <laughs> ah, party planning can be so stressful. But I feel so much better after vivisecting that butterfly. Oh. Fun fact, the most beautiful part of a butterfly is its gorgeous glistening stomach in it. Ooh. Oh, did Mr. Peel run off again? 
Oh, whatever. Here's party of activity suggestions, but just so perf. Can we just use one of them? We can just... Oh, wait, what? I thought perf was a was an insult. It, it is. We can just use one of them. Unless you have anything... perf was perfect. perfect. Yeah. Unless yeah. you have anything better in mind. Impress Miranda with a killer party activity. Well, not literally killer. Ideally, you're hoping for something fun, family-friendly, and assassination-proof. The security game. If you murder someone, you lose. <laughs> you were looking for a game that serves as the opium of the people, but there is no better opium of the people than actual opium, so a game about smoking lots of opium. Do it. Second. Really? Second. You yeah. sure about this? Do it. Seems like a... Do it. Do seems it. Seems like a bold <laughs> move. That's not bold, dude. That's fucking fun. Do it. Do it. Kill okay. Him. Do it. This was your decision. Do it. See? Fun. Ah, Do okay. It. Indeed. Told you. Bold, bold is like flashing your genitals. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Whoa, it. can you imagine how cute the surfs will look with their little opium pipes? Ah, oh, that would just be so precious. But of course, one can't protect an opiate without a magic outfit. Each surf will need their own opium pipe and matching opium hat and their own opium ascots. Yes, yes, absolutely. It'll be so adorable. Opium is the perfect party activity. Plus, it's family friendly. <laughs> yeah, get your kids hooked on opioids. Opium yeah. is a perfect party activity is the name of the first album by my band. Shit, what I ended up setting this name is going to be. Doesn't matter. You change your band name like literally every 30 minutes. No, no, no. This is the album by that band, though. Well, fuck if I can remember what it was. <laughs> okay, hold on. I'll read it. Mir Miranda's Kingdom produces plenty of opiates to stock the party, but in order to find a fashionable ascot for each and every surf, Miranda's father has to conquer two peaceful democratic republics. Two! Isn't Daddy the best? It wasn't easy to bring those kingdoms under the belt of its iron fist, but it'll be worth it for these outfits. <sighs> the world takes a step away from the shining light of democracy, but you take a step towards Miranda's heart. You gain plus two creativity and plus one charm. All right, we got our weekend. And spoofy. Me, ag me again? Jeez, all right. Goodness. Oh! Um, wow. Hey, I have a question, Shoopy. Do you think I'm weird? No, don't answer, because if you say I'm not weird, it'll just be revealing that you're weird, because we all know that I'm most definitely weird. And I'm proud of that, you know? I spent millennia as a tentacle to Eldritch Deity, and then I spent a while trapped in the totem, so obviously it makes sense. But I got a little overexcited by all the boring, mundane, very normal stuff happening at Spooky High that you're all used to. But not everyone can handle dating a weirdo, and I respect that. So, real talk, I'm really in the What? Shit what? <laughs> what? I told you you ruined her route. You had been playing. You just been playing a bit too friggin'. You are the. You are like the usurping. You are like the relationship usurping master, Josh. I wasn't even playing. Tell for her this that anymore. she. Tell her that. Tell her that steak bake sucks. Unless this is supposed to be me and they fucking typoed it again. But I'm also oh. really into spooky. Okay. Again. Okay. So I'm just like. <laughs> I will go on record as saying Steak Bake and Spoots McGoo are weirdos. High five! Yeah. <laughs> you know what to do, right, Orion? Yes. Right, Orion. But who do you think is the weirdest? One day Steak Bake and I... Fuck you yeah, fucker! Josh! No! Josh clicked for me! I broke my glasses. Oh, wait, what? Oh, yeah. Did you? Oh, my God. Wait. They don't look broken. Oh, they, oh the oh, frame they, is. Oh, my God. Oh my god, you got- Josh, you fucking asshole! <laughs> Why would you do that? <laughs> I thought you wanted Miranda! <laughs> He's out to cuck everybody! He Why would you do that? <laughs> He's just out to cuck everybody, it doesn't matter who did him wrong or whatever. But it's... that's- Right, but there's a difference between doing that playing the game and doing that by cheating. Hey, Orion cheated already as well, so I found everything was on the table. But you, but you didn't screw me? Not yet. I was the one who screwed you. Gee, I, I mean, you, you opened the door. I'm just playing by your rules now. I didn't fucking... 
I gotta learn my mistakes have consequences next time. 